Hi everyone. I hope that you are all having a wonderful day. I am currently taking my lunch break at work and going for a little walk in this open space. I love it because it's a brand new neighborhood that is yet to be built right across from mine and it just feels like so much open space. So I like to come here a lot to clear my mind. Um, this also, this very spot right here is where I did something that was super hard for me. Um, I had a guy in my life, it's a very, very long story that I'll get to, um, but this is where I set boundaries for myself and decided that I wanted better. I, um, I spoke to him on the phone over in this little area. And so now I like to come here and um, pray, meditate, whatever, um, just kind of clear my mind because it feels like my most powerful spot when I was one of my most powerful um, versions of myself and I decided that I deserved better. So another interesting thing happened to me this week. So I lost a very close friend of mine and I don't mean loss like she passed away. I mean loss like we're no longer in each other's lives. And I'm the type of person, I don't typically have drama in my friends, friend groups just because everything we do, we do with love. Um, and this friend, um, the, although there was love there, um, there were some differences, especially on political views. My insight on that is that everybody has a right to their opinion and at the end of it, we're still human beings and everyone has their why. Not everything is black and white. And to some people it might be, and if it is, that's absolutely okay. You're so entitled to your opinion and you have the right to feel that way. But I just don't like how politics divide us as people when we should be coming together, especially during these times. So. Anyways, I'm not going to get into the story of how that happened, but it did really upset me mainly because that kind of stuff doesn't happen to me. So, uh, but the ironic thing is when that did happen the same day, um, I actually somehow uh, through Bumble BFF made a really good new friend who I see in my life for in the future for a lifelong, uh, lifelong time um, as a lifelong friend. So also another cool thing that happened on that same day that I decided to let go of Anybody that no longer serves me or um, puts negative energy in my life, I also um, manifested a amazing job opportunity um, that is kind of in the works. Nothing's official, so I'll, let, I'll tell you more whenever it is or if it does become official. But what I've learned is that when you let go of things that no longer serve you, it makes room and creates space for the things that do. So at the end of the day, whether I get this position or not, it still, it took my mind off of the pain I was feeling and shifted my perspective into focusing on something that's more meaningful in my life, which is obviously having a career that, that you enjoy and that brings you, uh, brings you joy and fulfillment and purpose. So more on that later, but this is just a friendly reminder to keep your head up and everything in your life is temporary, unfortunately. Um, we're, we're here to teach each other, to love each other and to help each other grow. So whether it be your friend, family, child, animal, yourself, we all have an expiration date and we're all here for a very short amount of time. So really all we can do with this time is send each other love and live our best lives and, and live like it is our last day because you never know when this person's no longer gonna be in your life. So that is all. I hope you all have a wonderful day.